If I had been a bus driver, I would probably try to be friendly with people. The people I would pick up every day. Between you and me, it would be the only thing I could do. The only thing I could do for being tempted to drive all these people into a cemetery and run over as many tombstones until one of the passengers kills the crazy bus driver. Me. But luckily for everybody, that is not reality. I don't drive a bus. I drive a taxi. I don't have a route. And I don't give a shit who I'm driving. But this is not entirely true. There are the exceptions. No, not who is rich. It is very difficult to determine who is a nice tipper. Poor people I don't like, but it is not money. Do I look like I give a shit about money? Truth is, I probably have more money than any of you people. The money I was making when I was a locksmith would make you wipe your ass with your pathetic little paychecks. But this is not a story about your money. It is about my love. This girl, this woman, you have no idea. You have no fucking idea. No idea how beautiful this creature was. God woke up very inspired the day he created this masterpiece. You have no idea how blessed I felt. How holy when I met this angel. Thank God. We've been waiting for like an hour. Uh, 43rd and Broadway, please. It will be my pleasure. Of course. Hello. A week the man might have not found the courage to speak on out when in the presence of such beauty and drove in his silent cowardice. Me? It was like yelling out to a great canyon for the echo. Let me ask you a question. Let me ask you something. What is the funnest thing to do in this place? On this side of the bay? What? In Oakland? In Oakland, yes. Why? Where do you live? In Oakland. I've been living here nearly a whole year, but I have little to do for fun. Jeez, I don't know. Go to shows? There's, there's a pretty big music scene. Don't you like music? The other ones seem to be the chapter. You know, like concerts. Yes, and... yes, I love music. But the music in this area is, is like it was lifted by a gorilla. Just banging and screeching noises. No beat, no dancing. Yeah, well, it is a little more experimental, I guess. Between you and me, musicians can experiment when they are in science class, not on stage. Well... Um, uh, what about art? Do you enjoy looking at art? There's a lot of great art galleries. Yes, yes, that is a great suggestion. But, but still, this is too is lost to me. What is this art here? Scribbles on wrinkled paper, sewn together, crumpled on the floor? Do artists train inside a porter potty? Why is this so terrible? I do not understand. Well, it's a lot about the process. What? Yeah. Well, Sarah here is going to be showing right where you picked us up next week. Why don't you show up and shit all over it? Are you crazy? I would never do that. No. I would come and cheer. That's the reality. Oh, cheer. That's what I need. Maybe I wish I had some flyers. Most people just stand around and gossip. That's me. I'd be doing splits and chanting hip hip hooray. Yeah. My art's probably a little too... Do it in the porter potty. Or a sophisticated gentleman like yourself. No, it's not. Not in a million years. What about San Francisco? 
There's some amazing art over there. Yeah, and since you like dancing so much, they're overflowing with clubs. <laughs> well, yes, that is where I go into the clubs. You have no idea how expensive it can be, but that is something to have fun about. Yeah, man. Hell yeah. I love getting into this sweat on. It is expensive, and I probably wouldn't be such a boring shut-in if I weren't forever broke. Wow, I just had a great idea. You have no idea how much money I made when I was a locksmith. This taxi, it's almost like a hobby to me. Give me your phone number and we will go out to San Francisco and dance all night. Drinks everything, my treat. Mister, you got yourself a deal. You go, girl. Oh, oh. I was holding back tears when I dropped the princess in the goblin at the apartment. This was very bad for me. A cursed number, that was my only hope to reach an angel. After all, I am a gentleman. Would I be a pig to manipulate the situation to help me gain faith back on his path? I had to call. I could not wait. I had to go out that night. Her handwriting was repulsive. Hello? Is this Gladdy? This is Eddie's! Eddie's a taxi driver! Yes, Gladdy! Yes! Listen, I know in America you have three day rule before you are supposed to call, but I am from Israel and we do not have such a stupid rule. We call when it feels right, and between you and me, I really, really I feel like going out to clubs tonight. Listen, I'm about to finish work. Yes, we finish. And tonight, I would like to go out. No, tonight. Listen, Gladdy, what would you do? What would you do if not go out with me? What could be better? Tell me right now, what could be better? Yes, that's right. But, but listen. I think it would be even better if I went, you went, and your friend came as well, yes! What? No, no, Gladdy, no. Of course, it's you I want to go dancing with. I am saying it would be best if we had third wheel. Why, why would you be the third wheel? You're number two. Your friend is to balance our two wheels. No, three amigos, three bears. What? What do you mean this is always what happens? A beautiful man wants to take you, you and your friend out? Your friend? Gladdy, you are reacting the complete opposite way that you should be. Let's celebrate instead. There's three of us. No, no, why? Why do you say that? Gladdy. No! No! Okay, okay, well, Gladdy, if you are not feeling well, maybe it would be best if you stayed home. But, but listen, listen, give me the third wheel's number. I think I should talk to her about your insecurity. Hello? Gladdy? No! Whoa! 